He has a book where he can kill people who writes his name, but he only kills bad people. It's but a, it just it's, writes their name and they right, die? Okay, let me explain Death Note to you then. This dude, who is a boy genius, finds a notebook that belongs to a Shinigami, which is a, basically the Grim Reapers. The book has a power. He can write someone's name in the book if he knows their face, and he can write exactly how and when they die, and it happens. He starts killing all the bad people in the world. So he starts murking everyone, but then it becomes a phenomenon that the whole world knows about. But then the world's best detective gets on the case to find him. Now it's this genius with the superpower fighting against the world's best detective who whose name has always been anonymous so he can't kill him boiler alert right uh-huh okay. that's like the premise a big part of it is mm. philosophically is what he is doing correct he just he's not like going there and stabbing him in the neck himself it's like literally like delete delete playing god basically yeah he's starting to be revered as god no one knows who he is either no one knows he's the one doing it yep but they, he comes up with a fake name and they start worshiping this person as god because he's gonna kill those guys he chooses how they want to die he, he yeah. chooses how somebody dies